called Hello Yimla, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rikha Kadash, Double Honors, to the Apostles, and those great millstone, and our singers to hope left around the world. May Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, continue to protect and guide your steps throughout these turbulent times. This is your brother Dov, coming at you with another one. Okay? And today's lesson is the afflictions of the righteous. Once again, the afflictions of the righteous. We're going to start with the uh, definition of affliction. Okay. Misery, sorrow, pain, distress. Okay. Uh, act of humility, humiliation, mortification, punishment. Okay. Uh, to dash down, overthrow, to strike, a cause of constant pain of sorrow. Man. Okay, let's see what we got in where in a state of great suffering and distress due to adversity. A condition of suffering or distress due to ill health. A cause of great suffering or distress. That's right, because the uh, hopefully elect, which is the righteous in these times, are the only ones that's uh that's suffering greatly, okay, or in distress in these times, okay. Because uh, everybody is coming against the uh, righteous in these times. Mainly, that those are demons. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, that's on these people out here. Made two-thirds by people. Okay. And also, uh, main uh, enemy, arch nemesis, Esau Edom, these so-called white people. Okay. They are uh, constantly uh, afflicting us. Okay. Through, through oppression. But ultimately, it's Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai that's trying us, making us try and refine, okay? It will be uh, uh, come forth as gold, okay? And be tried and refined, okay? To those uh, immortal, uh, precious beings, okay? It's those kings of the earth, okay? King and priests of the earth. All right, first we're gonna get uh, Psalms. All right, Psalms 34 and 19. Okay. Psalms 34 and 19. Okay. okay. Many are, are the afflictions, these punishments of the righteous, okay, which is the hopeful let in these times. But the Lord, Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, delivered him out of them all. That's right. And Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, is going to deliver his elect in these times. Okay? Especially going to check his trouble when uh, these Edomites and these other heathen nations, even two thirds of our people, come after us. Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, is going to uh, make a way for us to be delivered. You know what I'm saying? Out of their hands. You know what I'm saying? Now, Barathe's eye, come up that hopeful number. You know what I'm saying? As long as uh, you keep enduring in this truth, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 staying charitable, brotherly, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 and rehearses the righteous acts to the best of our ability. And y'all about to y'all shots, go take care of the rest. Okay? All right, next we got uh, Joel 5. Joel 5. And 19. Okay, come. Joe 5 and 19. He shall deliver thee in six struggles. And he, and he's talking about, he's talking about Yahweh Shai. Okay, he's going to deliver his elect in six struggles. Yea, in the seventh, there shall no evil touch thee. Okay, and he's escaping those thermonuclear missiles. You know what I'm saying? Also, the uh, concentrated lady fire from the terrorists because they're going to be zapping uh, the Howard Shad's enemies to powder. Okay? And so it's in your best interest to uh, return to your power if you're an Israelite. Okay? Cause all these other heathen nations, man, they, they're going to be uh, recompensed or paid back for all their uh, wrongdoings against the children of Israel, which are you Israelites. Okay, you so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans, okay? All right, let's see, we got, uh... All right, let's get Proverbs 24. 
Okay, 24 and 16. Bro, it's 24 and 16. Come on. Okay. For a just man follows seven times. That's right. A just man is talking about the uh, hopeful let these times. And raises up again. That's right. Get back up and uh uh shake shake those uh those iniquities out. You know what I'm saying? Uh uh uh, uh get back into the spirit of Yahweh by Shem You know what I'm saying? By uh reading, exhorting uh the brothers, you know what I'm saying? Okay. But the wicked shall fall into mischief. That's right, and the wicked is talking about talking about Esau Edom. And also two thirds of our people. Okay, they are going to be taken to the devices that they have imagined. Okay, these thermonuclear missiles. They're also going to be destroyed by the same thermonuclear missiles during World War Three. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. We got a. Uh, gonna get a. Uh, John. Get John uh, sixteen and thirty three. John 16 and 33. Come, these things I have spoken unto you. It's talking about the uh, Yahweh shot talking to his hopeful elect. That in me, you might have peace. That's right. It's talking about Yahweh shot. Okay. And the uh, correct doctrine is true doctrine. Okay. Of Yahweh shot. The laws, uh, uh, the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding those scriptures. Okay. In the world, you should have tribulation. That's right. And it's, it's uh, faster approaching when these uh, Edomites are going to come down with great wrath and uh, put certain of us in prison, okay? That's going to be our tribulation, okay? Among other things, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. That's right. And by uh, his sacrifice, you know what I'm saying? That's where he okay in the world and uh, taking on all the iniquity of the children of Israel, which are the Israelites, mainly the uh, elect in these times, and overall, the whole nation of Israel. That's why his uh, crucifixion was so brutal. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, next, we got Acts uh, 14 and 22. That's 14, 22. Come, okay. Conform the souls of the disciples. That means the, uh, hopefully let the sin is true at this time, okay. Following the, uh, true doctrine and calling the names of Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shai. And following the, uh, leaders, the, uh, apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who are the leaders of Israel. You know what I'm saying? And exhorting them to continue in the faith, okay, that we must do much tribulation into into the kingdom of the Most High Yahweh by Shem Shai. That's right, because we have to be tried, and this is our, these are the conditions of the battle that the uh, hopeful elect had to endure in these times. As long as we endure to the end, the same shall be saved, okay. okay uh, let's see, we got a. Uh, Right, uh, I think that's yeah, James Con. Let's see, okay, okay. Uh, I'll hit James five ten, ten eleven. Okay, James five and ten and eleven. Take my brother, just no bullet, and the prophets who have spoken in the name of the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Okay, for an example of suffering, affliction, punishment, and of patience. That's right, because we have to be patient while we wait on Yahweh Shai, okay? And, and steady uh, growth through the Spirit. The power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai to uh, endure these things that we have to go through, you know what I'm saying, in order to be saved. Okay, all right, verse 11. Behold, we count them happy which endure, which is the hopeful elect. Okay, ye have heard the patience of Job, because Job, he had integrity, you know what I'm saying? And he, he was not going to go against uh, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, by no means, you know what I'm saying? 
versus just listen to his woman or anything else of that nature. And stay the focus on Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. And have seen the end of the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, that the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai is very pitiful and no tender mercy. That's right, because he's ultimately going to show mercy upon the uh, hopeful elect in these times. Because they are the only ones that's going to receive that, that favor and that, that grace, you know what I'm saying, in these times. Because they were preordained to, to be delivered at Yahweh Shah's second coming of All right, uh, we get a couple out of the apocalypse. You know, I'm going to end up on this lock here. Uh, it's uh, second, second Ezra eight, second Ezra eight, twenty seven. Okay, all right. He's talking about uh, acts of old. Okay, second Ezra eight and twenty seven. Regard not the wicked vengeance of the heathen. That's right. Don't worry about these different acts uh, of these he might start put to pass. These uh, most of that grain of rice. You know what I'm saying? When they crash the dollar, that's what's going to uh, snare a lot of people because they're, they're going to want to go back to their old life. But there's no old way of life. This is, <laughs> this is the new normal, okay? But desire are those that keep thy testimony in afflictions. That's right. We have to remember those acts of old. You know what I'm saying? Our forefathers. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, Believe and trust, and uh, knowing that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is going to uh, show up and show out for us, okay, in these times. All right, it's going to be uh, please ask us also Route 51 and 8 8 Khan, okay. Then thought I upon thy mercy, O Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, and upon the acts of old, how thou deliverest. Such as wait for thee, which is the hope of the elect, okay, and saves them out of the hands of, of the enemies. That's right, as long as the hopeful elect uh, uh, stay true to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah and do what's pleasing to his eyes, he's going to uh, deliver them and save them out of their enemies' hands, okay, in these times. Okay, verse 9. Then lift the eye up, my supplications, which are prayers, from the earth and pray for deliverance from death. That's right, because the uh, hopeful they are the only ones that's praying to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah and asking him to deliver us in these times from all our enemies. Okay, and also deliver us from the, the famine, the pestilence, and ultimately that sword. You know what I'm saying? And ultimately be delivered in those chariots that Yahweh Shah said come. Okay. But it's going to end this lesson. We're going to end off by saying Shalom, Kom Yasarala, Wabak Shabak Shabak Shah, Yabba Shim Yabba Shah, Kuwama Yabba La Yaza, Nawa Hashi Yama Elahain, Yapu Wama Yaza, Yahain, Wabak Shabak Shabak Shah, Yabba Shim Yabba Shah, Shala, make your part of my woman, Baha Rashah, Wabba Ball, a Baba Ball, a Baba Ball, a Baba Ball, Shalom.